It's Math Dad versus Science Mom in an engineering battle of wits. Who will take the prize? Join us as we go on a journey to show you how to host your own Paper Olympics. Before we get started with the first event, we have a warm-up challenge. Reproduce this design using only scissors and a single sheet of paper. Stick around to the end to see the solution. Event number one, a paper airplane throw for distance. Each team gets one sheet of paper. They fold an airplane and throw it three times from the same location, noting the maximum distance for each team. The team with the longest throw is awarded 10 points. All other scores are based off of the fraction of that longest throw that they attained. Math Dad takes an early lead. Event number two, the longest page. Each team is given a single sheet of paper and a pair of scissors. Each team has three minutes to cut the paper so that it stretches as far as possible in a single piece. The team with the longest paper scores 10 points and the other teams score proportionally. Science Mom comes from behind to take the lead. Event number three, the tallest tower. Each team is given four sheets of paper, a pair of scissors, and a glue stick. Teams have three minutes to build a free standing tower. The team with the tallest tower is awarded 10 points and all other scores are proportional. Math Dad ran out of glue stick. Looks like it worked to his advantage. Event number four, paper airplane hang time. Each team gets a sheet of paper to make an airplane. Throw it three times from the same location, noting the maximum time that an airplane stays in the air. The team with the longest hang time is awarded 10 points and all other scorers will be proportional to the time spent in the air. Math Dad still looking good. Event number five, blowgun. Each team gets two sheets of paper, scissors, and a glue stick. Fold the blowgun tube from one sheet of paper and make ammo, maybe darts or balls, out of the other paper. Take as many shots as there are ammunition from the page and note the longest distance of any shot. The team with the longest shot is awarded 10 points and all other scores are based off of the fraction of that distance that they attain. Math Dad extends his lead. Event number six, supporting a book. Each team gets several sheets of paper, a glue stick, and a dictionary to share between all the groups. Fold one or more sheets of paper so that they will hold the dictionary at least 10 centimeters above a table. The team that uses the fewest papers is awarded 10 points. Other teams lose a point for each additional page used. Well played, Science Mom. Event number seven, the step through. Each team gets one sheet of paper and a pair of scissors. Cut the page so that there is an opening in the center. Have one team member pass through the paper without tearing it. The first team to have a person step through will earn 10 points, then a timer starts, and other teams get one fewer points for every 10 seconds behind the finish time of the first team. Go Math Dad! Event number eight, paper airplane golf. Each team gets a sheet of paper out of which to make an airplane. Identify a starting point and an ending target. Throw the airplane from the starting point to the ending target and count the number of throws it takes to get there. The team that uses the fewest throws is awarded 10 points, and all the other teams lose a point for each additional throw it takes them to reach the target. The winner of the Paper Olympics is Math Dad. To run your own Paper Olympics, click down in the description to get your own foldable Paper Olympics instruction guide. And now, the solution to our warm-up problem. 